Now that I've shown you how to get through levels 1 and 2, I thought I would show you how to get through level 3 as well. Of course, the first matter is finding it. Which isn't that difficult, just head north and then west. You'll go west a few screens. Watch out for Zora. If you don't have the magic shield, her shots do hurt. In that cave, if you have the letter to the old woman and want to use it, you can buy some medicine. Once you get to this point, head south, and then immediately back east, and you're at level 3. It's pretty easy to go straight to the boss in this dungeon, but you're going to want the raft at some point, so you might as well get it on your first trip here. That requires a bit of a detour. No point fighting them just yet, you'll fight them in a moment. For now you want to head west. Let those enemies come at you around the corner. They're slow to turn, and that way you can get in some hits without risking too much. Just takes a little patience here. You don't want to rush out and lose your ability to throw the sword unless you have to. Of course, you don't have to use bombs like I just did. I, I have fun doing it, though, so... Might as well. That's what this is all about. Of course, save a few bombs because you will need them. These guys should drop a bomb here in a sec, the last one. Now you'll be safe when you come back out of the pit because the guards will be gone. Otherwise when it plops you in the middle of the room you might be right near an enemy. Now that we have the raft, we're going to backtrack almost to the start of the dungeon. These guys are finally going to see their last days. And if I was short on bombs before, I'm not now. You can attack through those blocks and you're not at risk, as long as you're attacking from the lower side. Your sword won't reach from the upper side. It's not really fair, but, you know... Life's not fair sometimes. It 
Those bubbles will take away your ability to stab with your sword, which is inconvenient. It's only temporary, but it can be a pain if you still have enemies to eliminate. And now we're at the boss. One especially well-placed bomb will do the same job as two or three do. And there we are, about half of the dungeon unexplored, but it doesn't contain anything interesting, so we're on our way to the next challenge.